And just like that, baby, we are officially live again on the official Waddle Podcast, and I'm joined by Trinity, which catch some relief. CSR, I appreciate you joining the show, sir. Yeah, man. What's up, everybody? Thanks for having me, Waddle. We are live from Miami, man. Beautiful. We're down here for the Formula One Grand Prix race going down this weekend, Sunday. I'm here on behalf of Chaser Water. Shout out to the guys. Catch some relief. Mr. Trinity, can you tell me about your product, your company? What is sure, it? sure. Hey, let me ask you first. Is Absolutely. it okay to cuss? Or Listen, we... I own the fuck out of this podcast. Oh, you can say whatever shit. you want. Brother. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I, I might just let some fly. You just never know. You never know. know. I like to know my, my audience there. But, uh, yeah, so Catch Some Relief was born uh, because fishing has its own inherent risk of inflammation. If you're out there on the boat and you're out there doing the outdoors the right way, then you're going to have some inflammation and some, some pain. That's right. Uh, I started the first hemp dispensary in the state of Tennessee wow. five years ago. Uh, and sold those five stores that I built uh, in 2019. But I still wanted to be in the space, but I do love fishing. And it plays well because it's the first CBD brand to market directly towards fishermen for right. this. Uh, saltwater, you know, freshwater doesn't matter. It's going gonna, it's gonna to work. Um, I enjoy bass fishing. I'm, I'm from Georgia, so don't get a lot of the saltwater fishing, although I do love to do it when I get a chance. That's right. um, but I chase those green fish a lot. And, you know, in a tournament on the water for a long time, uh, it's gonna just have its aches and pains. When you can concentrate more on the fishing instead of the pain, then you're a better fisherman. You're gonna enjoy yourself in the outdoors more. So that's correct. And that's now, where Catch and Relief was born. And that, you know, that we have professional fishermen that are part of the team and such. And uh, yeah, just general benefits of reducing inflammation and anxiety. And now we're gonna go all over the place with this interview, okay, sir, let's but do can it. you just confirm to me it is fishing and not catching, right? A lot of people get that misconstrued. <laughs> <laughs> catching is the fun part of fishing. Uh, yes, uh, especially uh, any kind of fishing. You're 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 fishing, you know. That's right. Uh, there's a third party involved. There's those fish are down there with their own mind. Yes, they are. You can have all expectations in, involved and all set up and every bait that looks pretty to you, and it doesn't matter to those fish if right. they don't want to bite. So. Right. And now, what got you into this field, CSR? Obviously, Man, as the an love avid of fisherman, cannabis, what got obviously. you into it? Yeah. The, the, I mean, I'm been a fisherman since I was a kid, um, but just enjoying cannabis. Uh, so in 2018, the pilot program in Tennessee allowed for uh, you to grow high CBD uh, crops. So um, just because of the enjoyment of cannabis, wanted to, to get up there and, and get involved with that. And we ended up having the first uh, tested and approved high CBD crop of the Tennessee uh, year that year. And there were about 40 uh, licenses at that time. Uh, the next year, there were over 600. Wow. So it exploded uh, since then. I was the first one to put the buds in a jar and actually call ourselves a dispensary. Um, and that opened up the, the understanding that this plant is, is not all bad. That's right. And, and so that's really what brought me to it. Honestly, we, we were, you know, we were smoking it. We we're like, I, you know, I don't really, I don't really feel anything. I don't know. Like we're farming, you know, we're moving plants yeah, around. Yeah, I was like, doing it. I feel good. Like, I don't really know what to say, but then we let someone try it who had really bad anxiety and didn't smoke cannabis because of the anxiety right, that correct. THC causes. Uh, she smoked a little bit of it and was like, oh, my God, I can't believe how much this really helped my anxiety. So then with the topicals, you know, with a, with a simple cream, you can take it and rub it on. It's going to reduce that inflammation. Um, I started noticing that this is even more medicinal than medical marijuana it, for inflammation and anxiety. Um, then understood that there's an endocannabinoid system in our body. Uh, yeah, there's no smell. No it's, smell at all. I was yeah, gonna say, that's, that's surprising. That's the distinction I make. Uh, the reason I don't have any sort of scent or cooling or heating sensation is because icy hot, biofreeze, all of those, they, that's how they, they work. So if your shoulder hurts and I stomp on your toe, now your, your toe's hurting, you forget about your shoulder pain. Correct. It's just changing the sensation of the skin so it's not actually doing anything. This is soaking in and reducing inflammation. Your endocannabinoid system is a homeostatic system that runs throughout your body and is, uh, keeps homeostatic through um, the central nervous system. So it's wildly important to us and it's got receptors all over the body and that's why the topicals work so well because they soak directly into those receptors and activate the inflammation reduction and you get the benefits of it from eight to 12 minutes. Right, and now obviously as a sport athlete, uh, as a basketball player, I'm friends with a lot of basketball players, football players, CBD, um, these things are, are, are big in those fields. Yeah. This is the first time I've ever heard it being brought to me as a fishing kind of thing, sure. in incorporated with fishing. I love it, and <laughs> what made you be the first to do that, sir? Well, just the love of fishing uh, in general. I, I was like, um, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to this uh, fishing 
Uh, it was the MLF event at Lake Eufaula, and I made up the, the label and, you know, put the topple that I'd already made together, put it a little closer. So, yeah, I went to the MLF event at Lake Eufaula and introduced myself to 80 fishermen, professional fishermen, and I noticed that they were very personable. Uh, they did not – they didn't act pompous as you, you would Correct, have you would some high-profile, yeah. you know, celebrities sometimes do. They were approachable. And I said, you know, I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and jump into this industry here and, and, you know, promote it as a fishing brand and – you know, then quickly realized that, uh, you know, making the, the brand a little more palatable for everybody, the catch and relief names there, it speaks for fishing. Yeah. And this is, you know, more adequate for all, all stores. Um, you know, for instance, we're, we're uh, distributed through Big Rock Sports. Uh, they're the, the North America's largest sporting goods distributor. And we also have a meeting with uh, CVS coming up. So wow. we're excited about potentially getting some topicals into CVS. As, That's as, big time as well. right there. So, yeah. Um, and I want to ask, is this product or your product something that needs not only uh, fishing uh, sports-wise, is this a post-recovery? Is this a preventative substance? Can you talk about that? Well, if you got anxiety, then yes, yeah, more of a preventative. Um, if you don't have inflammation, then you're just rubbing a lotion on you, you're right? So it's not, it's not necessarily preventative for that. But what it's tremendous for and what it's extremely underutilized for is physical therapy. If you're an athlete, you're going to get hurt, you're going to have injuries, and you're going to have to work through the physical therapy. The biggest part of physical therapy is the harder you work at it, the more benefits you're going to get for it, the more range of motion, the more recovery you're going to make, and the faster. If you can reduce inflammation before you go in there to start your physical therapy session, and even in the middle of it, stop and rub a topical on it, reduce that inflammation, you can work harder during physical therapy, you can recover faster from the physical therapy exercises, and your injury in general. Reducing inflammation, even just a little bit, reduces a lot of pain. Yeah. And I've always been curious, um, shout out to my mom. My mom's a two-time cancer survivor. I want to know, are oh, your products, are sir. they not for anybody or are they for all people, including They're for everybody. Cancer? You know, um, we've even had kids uh, that that are using the drink drops. Uh, parents are using this instead of ADD medication Correct, and, yeah. and, and types of things. But, you know, back to the cancer fighting agents of it. Cannabis has 113 to 168 different cannabinoids. THC has kind of stolen the limelight from those minor cannabinoids. And all of those feed the endocannabinoid system through ingesting phytocannabinoids. So we know that the endocannabinoid system plays a, a heavy role in the homeostasis of your body. Well, homeostatic system of your body, but that's what's helping regulate the, and fighting the cancer as well. Um, I, I can't speak to what I would do if my son got cancer tomorrow but i do know that if i was diagnosed with cancer tomorrow i would not take traditional treatments right. i would ingest many 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 minor cannabinoids in order to help my body fight it off naturally so hopefully it's a preventative for that yeah. uh, i like to think that having a healthy uh, well-balanced endocannabinoid system is going to help you you know prevent other things um you know i'm a big guy I, I don't know if you can tell that or not uh, out there, but uh, <laughs> I, I am a bigger fella, uh, have been my whole life. Uh, what's probably going to get me is a heart attack or a stroke. Uh, that is the number one killer in our nation. And CBD actually helps reduce arterial inflammation. There are studies that already prove this. So taking that, we're back to preventative. You know, yeah, I mean, that, that can really help. But speaking from an athlete's yeah. stance, you know, um, I think that also taking it and having reduced anxiety and and focus That's so right. that brings us to these uh boost capsules here um and i'll just take a few out to, yeah to show them uh these boost capsules are 25 milligrams of cbd 25 milligrams of cbg uh those are two minor cannabinoids obviously it's got b6 b12 uh, a little bit of ashwanda root and some green tea extract um it really provides a, a healthy amount of focus and anxiety reduction Anxiety is a wide range situation. Right. It could just be you, you're not able to sleep because you're thinking about the next day, or it could be that you're, you know, social anxiety and such. So with it being that and, and the benefits that it gives for that anxiety reduction, it allows you to focus. It, 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 it gives you that ability to just kind of put all those distractions aside and focus in, and then the added benefit of inflammation reduction while you go about it. And now, do you have any personal testimonies through your products that you've seen the benefit from? Can you speak on that personally? Yeah, you know, I've, I've got a story. Uh, it's really when it opened my eyes for the topical uh, use of it. Um, in my stores in Tennessee, we always had a sample of the topical out for people to use in the store because it works in about 8 to 12 minutes. If you have some severe inflammation pain, it's going to reduce that very quickly. So um, 
we opened a dispensary. We got on the news. It, it kind of exploded really quickly. Right. And we had a couple come in. They were eight, like 80 years old. And the guy was walking with a walker. And um, the blue-haired wife is in tow. It's classic, you know, 80s couple uh, coming in. Not not the 1980s, but an 80-year-old right. right. couple. Right. And uh, they, they come in, and, and I open the door for them. And I said, how are you doing, sir? And he goes, err. Right. It's really all he could get out. And his wife said he just got his staples removed from back surgery. So I was like, well, I'd love for you to use these topicals, see if it helps with any of the pain. And um, they come in, and he, she lifts his shirt up, and there's just scar from from back of his head. I don't know why this 80-year-old man got this back surgery, but he yeah. did. And so he's in a ton, a ton of pain. He could hardly even talk. And um, so she rubs the cream on him, and he's kind of, oh, oh, it feels good, you know. And he's rubbing it on, and then – um, I say eight to twelve minutes. Our products, our topicals work, and I give a money wow. back guarantee on that statement. And it came from this guy. Um, I'm talking to the lady about the endocannabinoid system, and you know the 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 husband just kind of walked off. I didn't, I wasn't even paying attention. I was Correct. just focused in on talking to the wife. And about ten minutes later, I look over and she starts crying, and I was like, Oh my gosh, what are you crying for? And her husband's over, his walker's over here. He's like 10 feet away from his walker, and he's like, I used to love smoking weed when I was a kid, yeah. like talking to this young guy. And he was kind of hopping a little bit, and he and he had his personality. He wasn't grunting. And his wife was boohooing. And I was like, what, what's wrong? She said, I haven't seen him like this in months. Right. And I was like, holy crap, man, just a simple topical right. gave this guy his personality back. You know, Because when we're in pain, you're not your best self. You just can't be. It and the biggest thing here is, like you said, you know, you didn't solve this problem. You just added some relief. Sometimes That's, we just need a little relief. Absolutely. Absolutely. The same thing with anxiety. You know, it just allows you to take that deep breath, you know, and, and, and people with crippling anxiety that that's exactly what it does the focus it's really what i'd like to for those minor cannabinoids to do is for people to understand is is from my limited understanding of it and from the world's limited understanding of the endocannabinoid system since we just discovered it that's right is when you feed your endocannabinoid system it's just like it's just like taking you know or eating your vegetables and getting protein it's things that your body needs and ingesting those phytocannabinoids is a great way of boosting your endocannabinoid system so that allows you to perform at your body's peak and so it's, it's not even so much as like just the anxiety and the inflammation as much as it is it's something that should just be in our diet Correct. and you know we're putting it in the chaser water here which is awesome by the right, way right right um, shout out chaser water yeah and you can just add these drink drops to that and just very simply have that in your system and taking it daily to constantly update your endocannabinoid system is something that's very important and something i want to ask is there any side effects to this obviously you know normal products out there you got the little fine print at the end am i going to want to eat a little bit of food that's what i do with my flour <laughs> any side effects here Trinity? right uh you know you could have maybe some dry mouth some like cotton mouth you know from from uh you know your thc edibles and Correct. such you know um speaking of the flower you know that's the thca that when you decarboxylate it, it turns to delta 9 thc people didn't even really that aren't like hardcore potheads didn't even understand what delta 9 was yeah. until delta 8 came out correct and now they're like no no i like the straight delta 9 well you know actually you like thc yeah correct you know, it's what you like and so so the side effects are absolutely minimal um a great thing about catch and relief products while we're talking about thc they are thc free so you're not going to fail a drug test. Right. Um, a lot of the companies out there, including the United States government, the military, say no CBD at all. And that's because probably 90% of the CBD brands out there don't offer a THC-free brand. They have less than 0.3% THC, which could cause a drug test failure. Right. Uh, interesting note about drug tests. Uh, there's an allowable amount of nanograms on a drug test for THC. Did you know that? I did not, okay. but now I am informed. Okay, so... <laughs> The reason there's an allowable amount of nanograms is not so you can smoke a joint and get away with it. It's because your body naturally produces endocannabinoids that show up on a drug test as THC in trace amounts. Already. So, so some people fail a drug test from taking CBD products that have 0.3% or more or less, but also some people don't. And the reason is because is their endocannabinoid system is either overactive or underactive. So it's all very individualized as far as like how much nanograms get into your system in that way and it's interesting to, to note that you know half the workforce probably has drug tests correct you know and, and so a simple you know something you did at your brother's wedding you know a month ago you could fail a drug test for but you could do a whole 
eight ball of cocaine yeah, yeah, 72 yeah. hours later you're, and you're, you're good clean to go. and free you know yeah get your suit it's, on it's it's ridiculous one of the last so. ones i want to ask you trinity i appreciate you stopping by the show if you were to go back and tell yourself five or maybe even ten years ago what you're at where you, where you are and what you're doing right now would trinity of old believed it absolutely absolutely sharks don't sleep period uh, you got to stay after it every day. I mean, you got to wake up and get better every day. So I, I've anticipated being exactly where I am, and and where I am is where I'm supposed to be. And uh, no, I think this is this is uh, right where I'm supposed to be, and right here in beautiful Miami, and enjoying your show. Yeah, really appreciate you having me. And on. a couple of wild old questions that I always yeah. ask these on Please my do. show. I want to ask you, sir, when you had children, did life slow down for you, or did it speed up? Good question. Um, it really it really made you reflect on your own childhood and understanding the impact of what you wanted to do and what you wanted to leave in this in this so in a lot of ways it, it speeds up like crazy because i just blinked my eye and he's 10 years old now. right but it does slow down at the same time because there's there's a lot of lessons to teach you you know i mean just the other day he was on a video game and he goes i joined this hitler server and they kicked me out and i was like why did you join a hitler and yeah, he said right. well because the guy told me to like go to this type in hitler to go to this server he was trying to get him banned from the game correct well in his he had no idea who hitler yeah. was right i was like man never know what i have to teach you you know like oh by the way we really don't want to associate with hitler or yeah, nazism yeah, yeah. we'll, we'll know, try to not, avoid that one if we can it's not cool you know and i explained who it was he had no idea and once he understood that so yeah you know that part i think it does slow down because there's daily lessons to, to learn and and to, to create Good question. I, yeah, wasn't, I, love I wasn't expecting that. It. And now, Trinity, man, what can we look forward to you 2023? What can we look forward to catch some relief, the whole brand, this year? Well, we'd love to see it uh, even more nationwide. We're in the fishing industry. We're distributed through Big Rock Sports uh, in the fishing industry. But I'd love to see it as a mainstream uh, alternative because if you go to your Walgreens or your CVS or any of these um, pharmacies that are selling CBD products, the most you're going to get is maybe a thousand milligrams out of like a four ounce or eight ounce something. Yeah. Um, our topicals have a thousand milligrams per ounce of CBD, which is a tremendous amount of CBD compared to the price. And our price per milligram is the most affordable on the market period. So I really see Catch and Relief moving forward nationally and just being in, in you know, five, 10,000 stores across the nation where, you know, available to you. So 2023, 2024, coming at you. Coming at you. Last Catch one before I let you today. get out of here, sir. I ask this to all artists and a lot of um, different people to come on my show, and I'll bend it for you. Would you rather sell $50,000 worth of your products, or would you rather have 500 people that you directly impacted and they could literally tell you what your products did for them? I've got the 500 people, uh, you know, that, that it impacts. Uh, and, and, and truly, like, in your heart, it feels great to have that. I do love when someone comes to me. I mean, you know, um, I forget her name. I'm sorry. The For Chaser Water. Oh, uh, right. She tried the drink drops. And she's had some back issues here just of the past week or so. And she was like, I can't believe it. Like, really? I feel like it's helped my back. Is this? Right. Is this? Immediate. Yes. Immediate. So I've had so many of those testimonials. And I love getting them. But, you know, your pocketbook. I'd, I'd like to sell to five, ten, fifty thousand 50,000 people at the same time. So, you know, like m money is, is what it is. You, tool. You've got to have it, you know, you've got to, you've got to move forward with, it, especially in our society. So, um, you know, I, I think that with those 50,000 customers, hundred thousand customers, a million customers, you're still going to get plenty of feedback from the product. And with the money back guarantee, I'm, it's going to be there for you, and I'll get those testimonials. Correct. Well, man, I appreciate you joining the Wild O Podcast live from Miami near Thanks the beach. This is Trinity, and we're going to catch some relief. Right on. Whew.